Yes, I'm your host, Rick's Mace. Yesterday, I went into a slot machine arcade. Started putting a bit of change into one deal or no deal bandit. Put 20 pence in, went up 20 pence. Started putting five pence in, and five pences started clocking up as pounds. So I put my change in, I left there, I sprinted to the post office, got a fiver's worth of five pences, went back in there, and I recorded part one. I'll show you part one first. Watch this. This is what happened yesterday. I started recording as soon as I got back from the post office the first time. Yo. <clears throat> Literally, yeah. Yo, I'm gonna put these I'm gonna put these fucking five pences in that machine and they clock up as pounds now. Watch this shit, yeah, watch this. I swear it down. I fucking swear it down. Extra life. I want you to get a lot of money. Hello. This will be the most sensational game.
fucking saw that, yeah? I'm gonna come back later with another fucking fiver. I've got to get to the post office quick, yeah? We'll come here by the morning tomorrow. I can get this shit. I went to the post office today. It's the next morning. I got another fibers worth of uh, five pences here. They didn't have um, a tenner's worth. I wanted a tenner's worth. Most of them are clocking up as a pound when I go in there. I'm gonna record part two now. We're gonna see how much we get there today. Fingers crossed, she hasn't clocked on. The people haven't clocked on and no one else knows about it so I can get all this money. Fingers crossed, this is a rare opportunity. Free money coming out of this thing. Every five pence is a pound I can withdraw. So I'm gonna go back there and see how much we can get today. All right, here we go. Got my five peas and that. Fucking let's get in there. The owner was in the shop. I knew she would be there. The owner's gonna be there at nine o'clock in the morning. She had her ears open. I could tell she was silent. She was going silent in the back. But this is the remainder of the fiver that I had. And there's a full 20 quid. I might have put one pound of my own money in there just because I got a bit paranoid. And I put a pound in another bandit before I left as well. So there's probably about two pound 50 there. And about 18 pounds profit there from this morning's go at it. I'm gonna go back there this afternoon, give it a few hours, hopefully another worker's there. When another worker's there, they don't know what's going on. And then I'll be able to hopefully empty it and uh, as opposed to being 18 pound up. But anyway, that's for nothing. That's more or less for nothing right here. Thanks to a faulty machine, faulty slot machine. Yes, I'm back again, second time today. It's about one o'clock in the afternoon. I'm gonna give it about half an hour. I'm gonna go back over there. Half one in the afternoon. If anyone else is gonna be on shift, it's gonna be then until they close at about five, half five. So I'm gonna go over there with the rest of these five pences from this morning. I can't find any more five pences anywhere. So I'm gonna to have to use my head later. Try and go in there a little later on as well. Go in there now and later on today. So three times in one day, we'll see how much I get by the end of the day for free, more or less free, five pence for the pound, lose a five pence every now and again. But yeah, fingers crossed I'll make some more money now. Pack 
Oh, fuck. Fuck. There you go, another 35. Off about three, three pound. Yeah, now I've got a tenner. Tenner's worth of five peas, potentially 200 pound. I just had like fucking, earlier on today, I had about 30 quid out of there, yeah? But I'm the only person that knows in there still. Is, I think I'm on, I can't remember, I think I'm on the fourth day now that I've been in there, but I've got to get back, get back, back fucking in there right now because i went in there earlier and the owner wasn't there and she's not there now and it's nearly closing time fingers crossed i got back in time i'm gonna get some money now give it a go bankers offer no deal make your choice There you go, just had 40, 60. There's the tenner back for the five pences and there's the five pences out of the tenner that I got left from this, from this day today. Yeah, go back there tomorrow now. I've just been over to the bandit place today and the bandit is off at the switch on the wall. I went there yesterday, emptied it. The machine actually owed me a pound. So I went to the counter, told the woman that the machine owes me a pound. She gave me the pound and said, oh, is the machine off, is it? She was walking over to the machine as I was leaving and of course they must have realised at that point in time that the machine is filled up with five pences instead of pounds and they've turned the machine off. They now know what's happening. So if you find one of these machines, you need to rinse it out. If you've got any five pences in your pocket, put them in the machine before you put your pounds in because you never know when they're going to start clocking up as pounds, yeah? It's been a lucky week this week for me. It was a lucky find. Yeah. I'm happy to have found this machine. Uh, altogether, this week, I must have had between 150 and 200 pound profit from this machine. So it has been a definite help. I've been your host, Rick's Mace, and you've been watching Rick's Mace TV. Make sure you subscribe to the Rick's Mace TV network of YouTube channels and have a nice day.